and Andrea tells me they should be arriving in Exford in Somerset about now. Good luck to all of them. Now it's exam season and one school in Cornwall is encouraging its students to use digital technology for revision. Bodmin College offer year 10 and 11 classes the opportunity to download revision podcasts. It wasn't the night that in our day, was it? No, certainly not. And as Johnny Rutherford now reports, revising from a portable MP4 player seems to engage the pupils in a way not always achieved by traditional methods. At Bodmin College, students say revision is more fun now that they have help from a bit of trendy technology. Certain websites that assist with key study points have been endorsed by the examination boards, like GCSE Pod, which allows students to download audio and picture podcasts to their MP4 players. New technologies are what students are used to using outside of the classroom um, and often shut off from using in the classroom. And we sort of started to engage them in using the new te technologies to involve them in um, being, regaining their interest in subjects across the curricula that um, they're kind of not less lost, lost interest in but have a diet of the same way of working in. It's not meant to replace normal revision and when you're out and about with headphones on no one knows you're studying and apparently that's cool. I have to fit in a lot of horse riding in my evenings and then there's not much time to sit down with a book and do traditional reading and revising like that. So if I put it onto this little player and then there's like a woman speaking and she goes through the different chapters and sections and explains it a lot easier. Normally I wouldn't have done much revision at home and if I can do it while I'm going like on a train or in the car then I'll get a lot done quicker and it's not interrupting anything else like going out or anything. In my day studying meant keeping your head buried in something like this the revision guide. So what if you don't have an MP3 or MP4 player? Well here at the college they're so into the technology they've got pretty much enough for every student to be able to borrow one. Johnny Rutherford, BBC Spotlight, Bodmin. Oh, how times have changed. As I was about to say I think I had books when I was at school. Not a slate. <laughs> no, not quite. <laughs> not quite a slate.